Okay, this video is on interpreting the remainder. Um, so, when we interpret the remainder, this is less about the process of uh, long division and more about what what the answer means uh, given the uh, situation. So, let's take a look here. Um, there are 46 students volunteering at a senior citizen's community. Uh, there's a maximum of six students in each group. How many groups are needed? Um, what you should do when you do the division problem is you should define what each of these numbers are to make sense of the answer and how we will need to answer this question. Um, so, for example, 46. 46 what? Well, it's 46 students. Okay, and then we're dividing it by 6. Um, <clears throat> so why is that? What does the 6 mean? The 6 is... Um, how many students can go into each group. So um, we have 46 students, and we're going to take every six students and put them in a group. Um, now the quotient, we end up with 7, remainder 4. Now what does the 7 mean? Well, <clears throat> the 7 means that 42 of these students, um, it, for 42 of the 46 students, uh, they're going to be put in seven groups, um, six in each of these groups. So what does the remainder four mean? Uh, the remainder four is that there, there's still four extra students um, that, uh, that are there. And what are we going to do with these students? Well, I mean, they're not just going to do nothing. They're, they're all volunteers. Um, so uh, we're going to go ahead and make a group out of them, too. So um, <clears throat> the question says, how many groups are needed? <clears throat> well, there's seven groups that have six people in each one, but we, we have four more students. So we're we're going to go ahead and make another group. So the answer is going to be eight groups, um, even though one has less than the other seven. Um, so that's what it says down here. It says there are four students left over, which is not enough for another group of six, but they are volunteering, so we're going to go ahead and make another group. So the answer is eight groups.